Hi, I'm Colin, and today we're going to talk about how to make a square corner using the 345 method. So the 345 triangle is useful in a lot of different applications in the construction world. Uh, today we're going to be talking about it specifically for excavating and laying paving stones. Um, but it's pretty easy because if you just use the 345 method or Pythagorean theorem, it's a true way to make sure that you have a square angle to work off of. The first thing you need to do is establish a straight line before you can establish your square line. So you take a stake and a hammer, hammer in one end, put your string line on it, and you're going to go down to the other side of your straight line. Hammer another stake in. This is where you can make any adjustments for straight. If you have something you need to work off of, like a foundation or something like that. Then you're gonna tie it off on this stake. Then you need to establish your perpendicular line. Um, so I usually like to go back here past the edge of my project and hammer a stake in. And the point is here is to cross these lines to make a point of intersection. And that point of intersection is your corner and that's what you're gonna make square. You're gonna run out here, establish your perpendicular line. And you can take a minute to kind of make this eyeball square that way you have less adjustment when you measure. Pull this stake out here, get your hammer. this string off. So after you've pounded all your stakes in and you've tied all your string lines off, uh, what you're going to need to do next is uh, measure out your string lines and mark them. So measuring from the corner, three feet on one line, uh, mark it, and then you would measure from the same corner on the opposite direction and mark four feet on the opposite line. Uh, and then by stretching the tape measure five feet across the two lines, you would then adjust it to make it perfectly five feet, and then you'll know that you have a perfectly square line to work from. Uh, you can do this by yourself, but it is a lot easier to have a second hand to help. So first, we're gonna measure uh, three feet on one of these lines. And the smaller the mark you make, the more accurate it'll be. Then we're gonna go on the opposite line and measure four feet. And then stretching the tape out to five feet, make sure you always use the same side of the tape on each string. We stretched five feet across here and we're about uh, one and a half inches off. So we're gonna have to move this line in the direction to make it exactly 60 inches in between. And that's all it takes. It's pretty much the easiest way to make a square corner for your paper project.